Welcome back to Gladiators of the Cage. I'm Chris Shovlin, Cody Tuttle, Brazilian Jiu Jitsu Purple Belt, Brian Fayok, who is the owner of Absolute MMA and MMA Gym here in Pittsburgh, and Jessica Evil Eye, all on site here in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania tonight. And Jessica, we have a star amongst us. We do. We, I actually feel kind of privileged to be uh, here working with Jessica Eye tonight. She's not only number one ranked at 125 pound female MMA, she's a uh, world ranked pound for pound number eight. 11 and one is a pro, she's gonna be making a lot of noise. You can check her out at Jessica Evil Eye, Jessica Evil Eye, E Y E dot com. All right, sounds fantastic. This is our Taylor Auto Repair fight of the night, our first professional bout, and it's Eric Calderon taking on Bexod Abdurakmanov. And this one is going to be a war. Eric Calderon is in the building right now. He is from Dallas, North Carolina, trains at Body Quest MMA. Expect to see a much different fight now that we've transitioned into the professional fights. These guys get to utilize more of their skill set. Striking to the head on the ground, elbows, kicks to the head. It's going to be a much different fight than what we've seen in the past seven bouts. I guess Calderon's been doing a lot of yapping coming into this bout as well from what we've been hearing. I well, talked to Calderon and uh, his corner man last night at the weigh-ins. Uh, they're, they're serious, and I'm telling you what, guys, I'm really excited for this fight. Bexod comes highly, highly touted. Um, he's decorated uh, collegiate wrestler. He's 5-0 and amateur. We're, you know, a lot of people are expecting a lot of things from this guy. Um, but I'll tell you what, Calderon and his, his corner, they ain't taking this lightly at all. And I'm looking forward to this fight, really. It might be one of my <laughs> my personal fights of the night for sure. All right, here comes Bekzad Abderrahmanov. He is from Boston, Massachusetts, and he trains at Team Nowhere. And I understand that uh, he's trying to make the Olympic team in his native land. Yeah, he's from Uzbekistan, and he was a D1 All-American. He finished third. So he's a highly decorated wrestler. Two-time All-American at Clarion University. There is our matchup, our Taylor Auto Repair matchup, if you will. After Rachmanov, 5'10", 155 pounds, a record of 0-0. Zero and zero. This is the pro debut for both of these fighters. He has a reach of 70 inches. And there's Calderon, 6 feet tall, 155 pounds, a 72-inch reach. You know, even though they're listed at zero and zero for both fighters, Calderon sporting a seven and two amateur record, and Bexod's coming in with a five and zero oh perfect amateur record. Neither of these guys are a joke, that's for sure. Mm. Here's a look at Bexod Abdur Rachmanaz. Interestingly, with with all of his wrestling background, he said one of his favorite fighters is Nick Diaz. Wow. Okay. Let's go to our ring announcer, and he is Dan Bogan. Dan? Ladies and gentlemen, are you ready for our first pro fight of the evening? Our first fight, fight number eight, our first pro fight. Fighting out of the blue corner, making his professional debut. He stands six feet tall, weighed in at 155 pounds from Body Quest MMA out of Dallas, North Carolina. Welcome, Eric, the show, Calderon. And his opponent, also making his professional debut this evening at five feet, 10 inches tall. He weighed in at 155 pounds. He is from Team Nowhere, born in East Pakistan, now making Boston, Massachusetts its home. Red corner, Bekzad Abderrahmanaz. So it is Abderrahmanaz versus Calderon as we get set for this first pro battle of the night here in Pittsburgh, PA. Bexod with the wrestling background, Calderon with the, uh, actually said BJJ is his preferred method. I expect some fireworks on the feet, guys. Chip Snyder is the referee. And we're ready to get it on. Calderon Southpaw. Southpaw stance leads off with a big head kick. Trying to gauge the distance, it looks like Calderon using kicks to do so. Interesting tactic against the wrestler. You know, throwing your leg out there, waiting for him to take it. 
I'll tell you what, Bexod looks incredibly relaxed. Very, very relaxed. You know, he's been competing at a high level for a long time. He had suffered a recent loss to Olympic gold medalist Jordan Burroughs in wrestling, so he is not short of high pressure situations. As you said, Cody. Using those wrestling skills right there. Yep. Dangerous, dangerous to throw those kicks out against a wrestler. You certainly called that one. Calderon's really going to need to make some space to get his hips back in and regain his guard. He doesn't want Bexod on top of him raining down these punches for very long. Absolutely not. And with the longer rounds now, uh, you know, these guys have more time to work. If they're on top, they got plenty of time to work. Now you mentioned the longer rounds are Taylor's auto repair round clock shows that we're at 345 to go in this round. These are five minute rounds here in the Pro Bout. Bexod's looking to take the back. He's already on the neck. One hook in, but finishes it real wow. quick. Wow. Lightning fast submission for Bexod. Amazing, but not surprising. You know, once he took the fight down to the ground, he was all over it. Bexod, Abder Rachmanov. Let's take a look at the takedown. Calderon left his leg out there a little too high. Bexod capitalized and took it down to the mat. Here's the submission right here. He's only got one hook in, but he's got his arm trapped. He used that to get on the neck, and as soon as he got his second hook in, the fight was already over. Bexod showing lightning fast moves and then brute strength. Great technique. Great technique by Bexod. I, I think we're going to see a lot more of him coming up here in the future. His first pro bout. You know, Calderon took this fight on short notice. Props for him to props to him for stepping up to such a great opponent in Bexod. Definitely a tough, tough matchup. Let's go to ring announcer Dan Bogan. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner by tap out via the rear naked choke at one minute, 26 seconds of the first round. He is Bexon Abderogdamanaz. Bexon Abderogdamanaz from the red corner. Bexon, fantastic job. Continuing your undefeated record, one and oh now as a professional. How do you feel? Well, good. I train hard. Was that the plan to come out and take the fight to the ground or a stand-up battle? I was going to take him down and then finish on top. Fantastic job. Anybody you'd like to thank? Yeah. I want to thank everybody who came and supported us. And I want to thank coaches. And I want to thank all of my, my fans right here, over there, all over. Thank you very much. Awesome. Thank you so much. Look forward to seeing you back. Back to you, Chris. All right, Jessica, thank you much. Bexod Abderrachmanos, two-time All-American wrestler at Clarion University of Pennsylvania. And there he goes. And coming up next, we've got more great action. It's going to be Wally versus Van Buren as we continue with Gladiators of the Cage.